Hello guys, and welcome back. I just recorded the first one a bit ago, and I really enjoyed it. So now we're here doing the second episode of Super Flat here. Okay, so I've been thinking in this episode, I think we need to make some huge progress. And huge progress, I mean, maybe like exploring another village or something. We'll see. So, first, I want to get this farm started. And, yeah, so there's no way other to do it than to just do it. Let's get this out of the way. So, my plan is I'll have, like, stuff under here, and then I'll have water flowing. And then it'll be like that. So, I'm going to build down here. And then go like this. That should work, and then on the, in this empty space, I'm gonna put water. So then, this I'm pretty sure this is too high for the slimes to jump up, right? Or me? Yeah, I think so. Huh. Definitely too high for the villager. Okay, so I think I'm gonna do one more row, and then that should be good. And it's sunset, and I do not want mobs to spawn, so I'm just gonna quickly sleep. Then we can get back to building the farm, and then I did tell you at the beginning of the episode I will try to explore another village today. Don't think you can turn me. Yeah. Yeah, you can. Right? But that will be a problem. We still have to kill them. That um, slime. Now I have to figure out a way to get under those blocks and get some water there. Okay, so if the place blocks under it, there's an iron golem. Okay, thank you, iron golem. That iron golem, like, seriously, just helped me out so much. I feel bad for killing you. Well, uh, all right, so that should be good. All right, now we have to kill that guy. But how is the question? What I do want to do is get a bow. Maybe that will work. But first. We need iron so we can get some water and then fill this up. Oh, this is gonna be hard to get iron. We have a long journey ahead of us. So first I'm gonna make a hoe and then put down these carrots. And potatoes are also gonna be really good because I can craft potatoes and the bake that I craft. I can turn potatoes and baked potatoes, which could really help. Because baked potatoes are one of the best food sources that you can produce from a farm, that like a crap farm. And I mean, we don't have any cows. Okay, so that should be good for now. I'm gonna eat carrots until I regen. So I'm gonna get full health from going exploring. All right, and there's nothing else stopping me. Let's go to another village. I'm gonna save these cords, so in case I get lost. Okay. What the? Just started using using the lunar client, and now I guess it does that every time you take a screenshot. Okay, so I don't want to go to the abandoned village. Okay, so there's a village over there. I use that. <laughs> okay, it's a good start. Let's see. Can't tell if I'm going at the same speed. Oh my god. Anyways, can't tell if I go at the same speed when I do this. I do not see a blacksmith yet. I gotta go. Yeah, I don't think there is a blacksmith. That 
kind of sucks. This is a lot of cobblestone. Is that a blacksmith? We'll see when we get there. Either way, there's more villagers. The reason I really want iron is first, I really want a shield. Because shields can decline slimes. Um, rain. And that would really help. Oh, see, see, like when you come near, slimes just like appear. That horde just came out of nowhere. Look at that. That one just spawned out of nowhere. Like, and they're very deadly. That's why I'm trying to stay away from them. <coughs> Anyways, here's the village. Start. Start. And some more crops. Good, I guess. More crops. And the good thing about this village is the la Oh, armor, armor. Armor is huge. Oh, that is huge. Now we have pants. <sighs> I mean, it's better than nothing. I know it's like... It's, be it's better than like... It's, it's better than nothing, but I guess it's not too good. I mean, at least we at least we're seeing the armor bar now. At, le at least it's in our view. Anyways, so next we have this. I don't know if you can break a brewing stand with stone pick. Okay, you can. Did not know that. So then we have this tall house. Don't know what that is profession for, but I'm pretty sure it has a chest. No, just yeah. This is the type of house that I was aiming for in my other village because it has a lot of space and it has a porch area too. But we didn't find it. But we found a different one, so it's all good. Is that my village? No, that's not. No, is it my village? I don't think that's my village, so... I mean, we have the coordinates, so... That's so. all. Right. So now, we can go get other brick shops. Is this one already looted? Oh, a saddle, that's nice. And nothing we can use to ride it at this point, I guess. This is an automatic emerald. I saw this. Because if you take the clay that's already in his workshop, and then you trade it for him, you'll get an emerald. Automatic emerald, guys. <laughs> Ten clay for an emerald is actually pretty bad in this world. Yeah. There should be like a something. Anyways, is this the same one? Or is there just like m multiple of these? Oh no, this is the same one. Anyways. Okay, so I think that's all this village has to offer. Really nothing too good. But we'll come back to it. All we want. Oh, another one of these. Another emerald. I guess two because six extra. Emeralds are good. We take those. Okay, so I think I'm going to check a couple more houses and head over to the next village. Those are good. Take that. Uh, oops. I don't know which village is mine at this point. So I don't know which way to go to go home. But I do have coordinates. I think I'm just going to keep coordinates on. Sorry, this makes looks annoying. It's pretty annoying, but that isn't the abandoned village, is it? No, it's not, but I gotta run. Yes, this coordinate is very annoying, but you know what? 
making content here. <laughs> so, if we can find a blacksmith at that village, that'd be good, because then we could bring home some iron. But, like, normally people would, with a bit of iron, they'd craft their first iron pick. I'm not going to craft a pick, because there's nothing to mine in this land. I will craft, though, probably, a, like I told you, a shield, and if there's any left over, I'll do an axe. Okay, so let's start. Oh, this is my home village. Is this my home? Oh, wait. This is my home village. Oops. Well, that's kind of annoying. I did not notice that. Well, I guess, I guess we know where our home is now. So we can go. That's the abandoned village. We already saw them. Sun setting or rising? It's setting, so I don't want to go out and then have to go back in. But, you know what? I'm doing this. Why not? Okay. If I smack this guy, will he die? This is so... No, there's blocks right there. You can just climb on them. I shouldn't be doing this. I know I'm stuck. Okay. Just gonna help you out of here real quick. I'm so scared to try to kill him because if it's hardcore, so if he kills me, it's over. Oh, yeah, sun setting. I'm gonna go. Oh. Okay, so four blocks. That's enough to stop them. I'm sleeping early tonight. I tried to get iron, but that didn't work. So at least we got the farm started, but we do not have water for it. Water's over there. Okay. So we need to get water, but how? That's the question. We, we could kill the iron golem, as I was saying, but he kills us. Which is more likely, in many ways, and that would be bad. Okay, so he just wants to stay there, meaning I can't kill him. Oh, this is bad. Oh, shoot. That's a lot of slime. Okay. I think I should actually check this out. Okay, that was close. I'll take food and apples any day. It's pretty nice just actually. So now they're hoarding that, so I think I'm just gonna break out the back. Thank you. Okay. I don't think I actually saw this part of the village much. Alright, so I'm gonna start taking the beds and replacing these villagers all at the center of town. So, like, this part of the village, I don't have to, like, wander all the way out here. So you, you're coming with me. So this house is basically useless. Nobody lives in it, and I just took its... There's no bed... If there's no bed or stand in it, villagers don't care about it. I watched, like, an hour-long video about how villagers work, because... I just felt like it. <laughs> okay, so this is the center of town. They come here for town meeting. So I'm gonna put bed down here. Work stand. We probably only want one cleric, so I'm gonna put that. I'm gonna want one of these guys. So now they're coming over there. Like, you for example, blast protection one on our bookshelf. I don't care about, so I'm gonna take this. I'm gonna replace it back there. All the other stuff. Now we begin with you, and that's some good trades. But I cannot afford them currently. See, like, iron tools and stuff is good at this point. We can trade up the full diamond armor with this guy, and that would be good. Alright, so I think I'm gonna feed my pigs. Okay. 
Great. So now we have more pigs. Oh, happy family. You know what? Let's get some pork chop. Don't let me... <laughs> so... Yeah, I just want a couple. I'll let the babies live. <laughs> Alright, that's enough. The rest can live. Now this painful cycle. Okay, so time to bring these back. Okay, cartography table, they're attracted to this. Don't want that. Cartography table gets moved. Actually, I don't really need a cartographer, but I'll put it here anyways. I can always get rid of them. Bed, you're moved. During the day, villagers are attracted to work stands, and during the night, they're attracted to beds. So now, see, um, like a bunch of villagers are around here. Oh my god, why did I overly confidently attack that slime? Here, let me introduce you to my friend that I like to call the Iron Gorm. Oh no, oh no, no, oh no. This is not good. Okay. Okay, okay. Um, this guy's angry at me. If I teach him to my friend over here, then that will do the work. Because I do not want to kill him. Alright, I'm going, you know what to do. Alright. And these guys are harmless. Yeah, these little guys are harmless. Oh my god, that guy is not harmless. I heard the bouncing sound and I was like, what? Alright. That's a problem. Oh, that's why this guy's stuck. Carry on with your life. Or now he's gonna kill them, and now we're in the time. Okay. So, now that everybody's over here, no bed in here, I just have to finish off the rest of the houses. You have a job. Smithing table. I think that is a tool smith. That's where we get our diamond tools eventually. You are important. And then farmer is kind of important. I'll move this too. All of this stuff is going to be useful. Because eventually these guys are going to be maxed out. Oh, I don't want anybody being a cartographer. We don't need maps. I wonder what would happen if we got a map to the Woodland Mansion. Like, where would it lead us? Because there's no Woodland Mansions. Wait, Generate Structures is on. It'd be cool if there was a Woodland Mansion, I don't know. Yeah, but there's definitely not like an ocean monument, for example. You and my poor friend are being relocated. I cannot currently do that. Because the slimes are avoiding me. Yeah, I definitely have to build a wall. Eventually one day, I will. But for now, all the villagers are going to be safe here. And yeah, I think that is going to wrap it up, guys. Another successful day. By successful, I mean not dying. So yeah, <laughs> I like how the beds are both backwards there. Moving the villagers to the center of town will be a big help. And I'm trying to move that guy, but he's just being swarmed, so I can't do it currently. Is there a bed in here? No. 
but I know I dealt with that. I don't see anything in here. Okay, so I guess I will see you in the next one, and bye.